Hi, this is Siri Lam again, back from social distancing uh, life, here to talk to you about connecting your Google Classroom to your Redeker so that the grades that you put into Google Classroom, now that you learned how to do it yesterday, can magically appear um, in Redeker, and you don't have to do the same work twice. It's a beautiful thing. This is a new feature that they put out, uh, and it's pretty awesome. So I've signed into my grade book here already. I'm actually using a class that I don't um, have any grades in here yet so that you can see how this works without me revealing private student data. Um, so the first thing that you're going to want to do um, is all the way up here on the top of the toolbar. It says classroom. You're going to click on classroom and you're going to press link account. This should bring you an option to sign into Google Classroom. I give it permission. And now what I notice um, is two things. First of all, the icons here have turned green, okay? Well, it's really one thing. The icons here have turned green. The next thing I need to do is I need to link my individual grade book. That first step linked my whole Redeker account to my Google Classroom account. Now I need to link my individual grade book to that individual class in Google Classroom. And to do that, I click on the little classroom icon that's next to the name of the class. So I click on this. I wait a moment and I choose the class that I created already in Google Classroom and I click link. It asks me for confirmation. I say yes, I'm very sure that I want to link it. And then what this will actually do is if you have students um, who are in Google Classroom and not in Redeker, it will actually invite them into the class. But my students did not need to be invited because they're already there. So now my classroom is linked. My Google Classroom is linked to this particular Redeker gradebook. I would need to do that for all of my classes. So any class for which I have a gradebook and a Google Classroom, I'm going to go in. I'm going to do this. I'm going to press link. Now, the better question is, how do I get the grades that I put in Google Classroom into my Redeker? And the way that I do that is through add a column. This time, though, when I press add a column, I don't start filling in the information. Instead, right up here, I choose link classwork. And what this does is it brings up all of the assignments that I've given to my class. Now, it will only bring up assignments that are put in as assignments. It won't bring up materials and it won't bring up questions. Um, I wish they did have it that it brought up questions and that's a feature that I hope that they'll get to. But currently, it only links assignments. And it's important that you've already hit return on the work to students because it will not be able to import the grades if you have not yet returned them. So I link it to um, an assignment that I've created and I press link. I confirm that I'm very sure what I want to do. And you could see here, it automatically filled in the name of my assignment. If I had instructions, that would be here. This is pre-distance learning, so I didn't have instructions. Um, that would be over here. I can choose which um, category it fits to, it pulls the maximum possible points from what I have registered in um, Gradebook. I make sure that it's a shared column and I hit create. And I wait a moment for stuff to happen. during which I reflect on the fact that this week feels like it's been far more than only four days already. You can hear that my voice is shut, and I hope that uh, social isolation is treating you um, in a way that you feel like maybe you can sort of kind of handle it, or at least hang on for dear life. Um, and I hope that these families are safe and healthy. And now we'll sit in an awkward moment of silence while I continue reading. Okay, and now you see that we have finished waiting and the column has come here. I actually specifically chose an assignment that did not yet have grades 
in Google Classroom because I get I did not want to reveal grades. But were you to have grades already in Google Classroom, those would automatically come here. So one thing to keep in mind is if I would try to edit grades here, you cannot edit the grades in Google Class in I'm sorry, in Redeker anymore. You actually have to go back to Google Classroom, edit them there, and then you just press on the little classroom icon here and it refreshes the grades and makes sure that everything is um, up to date. Hope this is helpful and I will see you back for Comment Bank in Google Classroom.